Hi, just a quick uh, follow-up video to the Energizer AAA Alkaline battery leakage video, LinkedIn if you haven't seen it, um, where this uh, GPS, uh, like real old uh, GPS uh, track stick was sent into the mailbag by uh, EVblog forum member Hal Sion, and it uh, the batteries leaked. He put brand new Energizer uh, Max batteries, I think they were, in them uh, before he sent them, and they just, yeah, and it sat on the mailbag shelf for a couple of months and they just leaked horribly usually it's you know the Duracells that are infamous for uh, leaking but no the Energizers did it as well so anyway I've got a video on that so what I did is I uh, cleaned it up and I put uh, the exact site I found the exact match uh, Energizer Max uh, batteries at uh, my local store here and I put them in here um, as a test and I've sealed it up because it's kind of sorta like rubber baby buggy bumper sealed like around here so anyway I and I turned it on um, and yeah, you can see it's on and I've left it there now it was November 24th when I did that so it's almost two months so yeah I just got the itch to um, open it and check it out I haven't opened it up since so if there's any like you know internal gas build up or anything like that you know it'll it should still be in there just like it was although it was probably it wasn't really in a seal was it in a sealed mailbag package anyway not sure whatever it's been sitting on my bench for practically two months now and I thought we'd take a look at it uh, and for those that were wondering, no, it wasn't transportation that did this because these were sent from basically the greater Sydney uh, region. They were sent by road. They wouldn't. They didn't come by air. Um, I know where Hal uh, lives, and he, yeah, it, these were sent. Um, they would have been sent via Australia Post Road from within the Sydney area. So anyway, um, let's crack it open and have a look, shall we? So yeah, yeah, it just, like it just poor. <laughs> bit of suction there but that would just come from the friction on there is it uh yeah it's here is it oh oh no no leakage no leakage but is that is some residual stuff i mean I, I thought i cleaned this up pretty well but it looks like have they no like that what the white crusty stuff was not there before, I thought I cleaned this up pretty well. No, it's not going to leak there. It's going to leak on the bottom. That looks... That looks pretty good. Right, focus, you bastard. Come on. Don't have to put my macro lens on. Um, no, that looks fine. So, it looks like... Maybe... I didn't clean it up well enough? I don't know. Or is some more... Has more gas leaked out or something like that perhaps I'm not entirely sure but it certainly hasn't leaked and anyway there they are the energizer that's right they're the max plus um 0319a is it day code on there but uh, yeah, uh, these were deemed to be almost uh, certainly r rolled off the same production line as the uh, other ones that we got and no they weren't some fakies or anything like that so anyway um that looks a little bit crusty burger in there and I thought I cleaned that up pretty well but no it's almost as if it's come back that's interesting but nothing on the bottom of the batteries let me whip the macro lens on my times 10 Optica macro lens and let's get down there sorry I'm not going to edit this and there we go no there's been there's no visible leakage there at all really that i can see anyway on this camcorder screen so nope nope zippity doo dah but yeah have a look inside there because all that crustiness wasn't there before i swear i cleaned this out properly and uh nope it, there's so as that started like it hasn't formed on the batteries but it's certainly starting to form on the contacts i don't know if there's any metallurgists out there who can uh tell us like oh i doubt dave you didn't stand a chance there's no way you could have cleaned that it was always just gonna come back and blah 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 or did it come from uh like inside like the pcb because i couldn't open this because i haven't done a tear down it's kind of like you know sealed although 
uh, as in like you know well like ultrasonically welded case or whatever um, but uh, you can certainly see the PCB down there so there is like it could have leaked in the PCB and then I didn't get clean that out and maybe that was causing it I don't know sorry not the world's best test but I thought I'd do it anyway so there you go that's a null result should I put the con uh, batteries back in I don't know leave it in the comments down below given that that is still there but is that due to last time hard to tell but there's definitely no leakage from the actual battery that doesn't mean that there's no like um gas discharge from it though so i don't know let me know what you think in the comments down below catch you next time